hello and welcome to jasonnewland.com My name is Jason Newland and this is Let Me Bore You to Sleep Please only listen to this when you can safely close your eyes What other things do I normally say at the beginning? Oopity doopity doo. No, not that. Remember to eat your oranges? No, that's not it. Oh, I don't know. Anyway, check out my website. It's got all of my recordings and that is a lie it hasn't got all of my recordings there's about a hundred or so that aren't on there so let me explain this um it's got most of my recordings so i think there's about 1057 or something like that recordings on the website And with the self-development slash self-help sessions, there's a lot that aren't on there. Um, But they're the shorter ones. So a lot of the recordings that are less than 15 minutes aren't actually on the website. Or my podcasts so perhaps I need to change that because some of that stuff's pretty good I think I'm a little bit biased I suppose but remember years ago I actually deleted all of the short self help sessions from my YouTube channel and a few people actually asked me to put them back on because they liked them because it's a nice uh, short listen or watch and most of those videos were actually me on video talking as opposed to kind of what I do these days where most of what I do is now just audio although bing bong bing I'm thinking of making some videos. I know, exciting. Ooh. So, I don't know. The thing is, is what I've been doing, and the, real, the, the reason I realised that I've missed quite a few of my recordings out of my website is... I've been going on my YouTube channel and going through all of the actual videos, like the previous videos where I'm actually there moving around, talking and, you know, on camera. And I was sort of surprised at how many of those aren't actually on my website or my podcast. So what I've been doing is... I'm going to come back to that another time Uh, deal with that another time but I've been adding the videos to my website so for example um, reduce your chronic pain uh, by um, a dog licking your toes or something this is a recording similar to that so I already had the podcast on there the episode and now I've added the video onto that page from YouTube I've embedded it there's still a few hundred to do so I'm only probably about 20 in and there's 
Yeah, it's probably about four, 450 possibly videos for me to embed. So I won't be making extra pages. I'll just be including them in the pages that are already there. And then that gives you a choice. You can watch the video, which some people might want to do, or you can just listen to it on the podcast, which will have a player on the on the page. And I um, I didn't forget that I made videos, but videos was predominantly what I did for a long time. That was the the main thing that I did, and and I can't, for some reason I kind of forgot about it. I forgot I forgot what I looked like, and it's just kind of strange to see this uh, this little Jason on the screen growing up in front of my eyes. From such a young, young boy in 2006, you know, it's like amazing, a young boy, I was only 35 years old at the beginning of 2006, and now I'm 49, it's like, wow, all those years, and I I think I was even clean shaven, when I did the first video, and that's not on there. Although I do, I can get access to the first video, but it's on a different video channel. And it's actually in black and white, can you believe? Black and white video of me. Hello, welcome to www.jasonnewland.com. I'm talking very posh like that. And Thank you for joining me. I hope that you appreciate and benefit and gain some kind of uh, wonderfulness from this recording, this video. And yeah, talk, it was very much like that. Uh, tested out a few different talking, talking styles. Yeah, I think the next one I was like, Hello, welcome to... Uh, uh, Relaxation, hypnosis, uh, get yourself relaxed. That's it. Uh, that's right, get, get relaxed. Lay down, lay down, feel relaxed. Your legs relaxed, your arms relaxed, your hands relaxed, your face is relaxed. Now, oh, relaxed. That wasn't as popular as uh, some of the others. And so I kind of thought, oh, I'll try out different techniques. So it's like, I suppose uh, I'll try the uh, the st- <laughs> I'll try the show busy you know technique. Uh, now you are going to feel so relaxed and calm as you I sit you there, there and I look at that and you look in my eyes and I touch the shoulder and your shoulder goes relaxed because I know, <laughs> and then you feel so calm and now you are so relaxed. Oh, <laughs> so I kind of uh, I didn't go down too well either. It, <laughs> I kind of already had this voice. Although I don't talk like this all the time because I do, I suppose I'm a little bit slower when I make these recordings but I'm quite comfortable at this speed it's quite a comfortable comfortable pace for me because I actually find myself 
relaxing and I'm sitting here in my big black squeaky chair which needs replacing the actual the head bit the headrest from the head bit the bit where my head goes it's worn out it's actually worn out the armrests are worn out so I, I know I've had it for I don't know it's not four years yet but I'm getting on to four years I kind of expected it did it did it did it to last forever and ever and ever but it hasn't no it hasn't it really hasn't and I don't get it I don't understand but uh <sighs> so the website is I'm quite pleased with how the website's coming along I'm just yeah I'm quite pleased with it and it makes a change to just be dealing with only one website although my plan soon I don't know how soon might not be for a couple of months it might be next week I don't know is to get the other websites up and running again I just like the idea of having a podcast website you know just have a website where the podcast lives online so it's got its own little house and that's just for the special podcasts the the most popular ones which this is among those um, although oh are you ready for this are you ready for months my most popular podcast has been Deep Sleep Whisper Hypnosis and I think I've got about 87 or 88,000 downloads on that podcast since November last year so the last yeah 10 months and it has grown exponentially I suppose but that's always been the one at the front so I think this podcast has got about 70,000 downloads so there's quite quite a bit ahead really I know it's not really a race but you know I find it mildly interesting in fact I could actually tell you the exact stats Shall I do that? Yeah, I'll do that. Why not? Excuse me. Oh. I'm sorry if the squeaking squeakies are annoying you, but I actually had... I've been uploading some recordings to a new podcast so I've I literally had the web, the laptop within reach so yesterday I got 2,548 downloads which uh, Sunday, Monday and Tuesday I had a lot more than that actually Sunday I had 3,033 downloads Monday 3,314 downloads Tuesday 3,431 downloads Wednesday the 18th of September 
2,938 downloads. Bit of a dip on Thursday. 1,941 downloads. And then Friday the 20th, yesterday, 2,548. Although yesterday I only made one recording. So that kind of, you know, Thursday was just... Uh, I don't think I made any recordings at all on Thursday. Thursday the 19th. Yeah, I don't know. And today, according to this... 140 downloads and that's in the last 23 minutes it normally like clicks over about 3 o'clock sometimes half 2 but 3 so I get a little buzz out of it because <laughs> it's a bit sad really but See, at the moment, I've got uh, total downloads for the for all my podcasts since November the 21st, I think it was. So it is literally 10 months. 457,015 downloads. And total plays, 19,223. So... 457,015 downloads and I just uh, redo the page refresh the page and it's now 17 so two more downloads just in that time so I quite like doing that I'm going to refresh it again now Still 17. Still 17. Refresh it again. Come on, go up. 17. 18. Right, refresh it again. So I could do this all day. I love it. I'll refresh it one more time. One more time and then I'll stop. Oh, come on. Okay, one more time after that. Okay, so I'm going to leave it at 018. So 457,018. And then I'm going to come back in a couple of minutes to see how much it's gone up by. So. So the deep sleep whisper. Did I say 87,000? Well, I lied. It's 86,228 and 2,851 plays. Now that was the top, it's been the top for absolutely ages, ages and ages and ages until this week when the Hypnosis for Sleeping Deeply podcast overtook it. And that's 86,925 downloads. And then a third. See, this, this one we're doing now, it's not even third. The third one is Sleep Hypnosis Sleep insomnia hypnosis at 77,662 so that's third then fourth is this one let me bore you to sleep and it's less than I said I think I said 70,000 didn't I it's actually 65,300 downloads however it's got more plays than any of the others so this one's got 4,858 plays so it's kind of the equivalent of nearly what is the equivalent of 70,000 but 
So what? So that's four. One, two, three, four. Fifth is the relaxation hypnosis for stress, anxiety, and panic attacks. And that's 34,754 downloads, 1,359 plays. And the last one that's, uh, is the Sleep Hypnosis Weekly at 27,900. And they are the most popular podcasts that I have. So there's one, two, three, four, five, six. So I've got 40, 45 podcasts, I think. So got six that are the most popular out of those although there's a few that are starting to regrow so the 28 day stop smoking hypnosis course has now gone up to 8,197 downloads and there's only four um, recordings plus the extra bonus one which is the whole thing compacted into one recording so that's grown. Fall asleep counting sheep has been growing and it's now 1,500. The relaxation hypnosis is now 10,732. Self help and self development hypnosis. 14,225 uh, Sleep Hypnosis with Music Podcast 10,611 And the only other one that's kind of in the double numbers is Where is it? Uh, so Jason Newland free hit did I say Newland I mean new land free hypnosis service 14,576 so that's the the podcast I just add all the new stuff on whenever I produce something new so so let's have a look total downloads four five seven and 18. Let's see if that's changed in that time that we've been talking. It's now 20, it's not by much. It's now 23. 19, 20, 21, 22, 5. So, five people have downloaded episodes or listened to the recordings or started to listen during the, the reading out of those stats. And I get a little bit of a, a little bit of a, a tickle, a little bit of a tickle out of it, because the idea that pretty much any time of the day, someone somewhere in the world is listening to me. It's kind of funny, really, isn't it? That shit's quite groovy. It's a groovy, 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 the groovy. So sleep hypnosis weekly. I need to make a new one there. So what happens? The last one was the fifteenth of September. Sixteenth, seventeenth, eighteenth, nineteenth, twenty, twenty-one, twenty-two. So tomorrow I should make a new one. So the 15th, I had 277 downloads. And then it goes down gradually throughout the week because people have already downloaded it. So Monday, 16th, 204 downloads. Tuesday, 164. 
Wednesday 160 Thursday 143 Friday 118 and today so far 5 and I just find it I find that interesting just I try and figure it out but I can't I can't figure out where I try and figure out the stats and where people are listening and how I can make it a bit better and how I can reach a larger, larger audience but I mean with the deep sleep whisper this week so far uh, Sunday the 15th of September 387 downloads Monday 444 downloads Tuesday 447 downloads Wednesday 474 downloads Thursday a bit of a drop 269 downloads Friday yesterday 486 downloads Today, I've already had 59 downloads. Wow. So, 17, 6, 17, 18, 19. Ah. That's interesting. I didn't make any recordings between the 8th and the 15th. I wonder what I was, uh, let's have a little look. Just wondering how far it went down before that. Oh, it just shows, if I don't, when I go too long about making a recording, it can have an effect. So I made a recording on the 8th, and I didn't make a new one till the 15th. So the 8th of September, I had 691 downloads. The 9th, 308 downloads. 10th, 307. The 11th, 258. The 12th, 254. The 13th, 389. And the 14th, 201. So the 13th was quite good considering I hadn't made a recording for nearly a week and then the 15th you know started to grow again. Ah. I do wonder what isn't it? it's quite weird because you know I'm kind of thinking oh this must be boring for people to listen to that's the point isn't it <laughs> that is the point um, so let me go through the hypnosis for sleeping deeply which is now my most popular podcast with 86,931 downloads and 1,897 plays in the last 10 months which means That's going to hit the 100,000 for the year. And I imagine so will a deep sleep whisper. So I'm quite happy with a, like one podcast with 147 episodes or whatever it is. Deep sleep whisper. To reach 100,000. Or that would probably be 180 episodes by then maybe 200 even but that would be groovy I'm, I'm pleased with that 100,000 this this gives me I just I enjoy looking I'm not even into numbers that's what's weird about it and it might not be weird not to be into numbers but I'm not if this was a test 
or it was handed to me in an interview or something or by my boss not that I have a boss at the moment but I'll be like oh oh, these numbers it's it's a graph it's a chart Uh but because I understand what they mean what the stats mean I kind of and it I'm connected emotionally to it I don't know it's just it's fun and I'm just looking forward the two the things I'm looking forward to is the total downloads reaching a half million which will be I don't know averaging two and a half thousand a day three thousand a day so three six three six nine two two and a half I can't, I'm not trying to work it out. Let's see what it is now. It was 26, now it's 32, okay. Um, so 457. It will be 460 by the end of today. Which means, it just means it needs 40,000. So that's... I don't know, maybe 13, 14 days? 3, 6, 9, yeah, about, th- let's say 14 or 15 days. So by pretty much the first week of October, oh, we reach a half a million, which sounds better than 500,000, I think. And I, would, I wanted, really, really wanted to reach a million by the end of the year but that leaves me with October, November so three months to do it in and I don't know what 500,000 divided by three is but it's 300,000 by one 150 a month would be three four hundred and fifty thousand so hundred and seventy would be hundred and eighty thousand hundred and seventy five thousand a month would be four hundred and ninety five thousand So we're looking a hundred and seventy seven hundred and seventy nine I don't know. Hundred and seventy it's hundred and seventy something, isn't it? So we're looking at hundred and seventy thousand a month. for three months and I'm not reaching at the moment I'm reaching what's 30 times by three in fact I can find out exactly I can find out exactly custom if I go back I'll go back to statistics for the whole thing so I go custom to November 21st to now okay so highest month I've had is July and now is 78,142 downloads August was 72,407 and this month so far there's still 10 days to go it's 55,394 so 
three, ten days, thirty, fifty. So I guess I'm looking at about eighty, eighty odd thousand for this month, September. So to have that jump to a hundred and seventy odd thousand for the next over the next three months. Well, that would be lovely. I'm not sure if it's going to happen. So, but that's okay. I'll, I've never, ever, in all my years, ever managed to uh, have a total of over half a million in a year. Or half a million for any podcast. The most I've had in the past was about two hundred and twenty thousand, I think, or it might have been two hundred and forty thousand. But it was about two hundred thousand, roughly ish. And I've had that a few times on podcasts on SoundCloud. And um, so this is I've kind of broken my own records, as it were. So. It's two months until November, so I've got three thousand times by three. What's that? Three, six, thirty, one thousand days, thirty-three, thousand, three, six, nine. So I'm looking around eighty, ninety thousand a month as it goes up. So let's say ninety thousand for the next two months October, November so it's 180 which means that will be 4,000 180 so it's 537 no 637,000 so I reckon I'm about 600,000 by the end of uh, November and then hopefully 700,000 at least by the end of the year which means by March, April I'll hit the million which would be nice the thing is on top of that I'm looking forward to the the stats for the individual podcasts to be a hundred thousand plus so I've got one two that are kind of only fifteen thousand to fourteen thousand away from that so they'll be hitting that next month then another one at seventy seven thousand six hundred and sixty two so that will probably also be hitting the 100,000 next month. And then there's this one. So this one is 65,301. I don't know if it's changed. Blocked it, it's not working now. Sixty-five thousand, what's it? Six five, seventy-five, eighty-five, ninety-five. So it's still thirty-four thousand seven hundred. So that might not reach the hundred thousand until November. But I'm looking forward to that because just to have one, two, three, four, four of my podcasts being a hundred thousand plus uh, on the stats after a year. I'm I'm pleased with that. I am. Yeah, I'm pleased with that. Doesn't take much to please me, really. And then um, I've also got other podcasts and with other hosts as well. 
Um, just trying to get myself out there, you know, trying to reach as many people as possible. So let's have a look at the hypnosis for sleeping deeply. Let's look what kind of stats I've got for that one. So this is the the most popular one out of all my podcasts now. Not by much, but part of the reason for it is oh, is the amount per day is higher, so it will continue to become. It's just going to continue to grow a lot quicker than the others because it's got more, it's kind of grown bigger, quicker. I don't know if that makes sense, but I can give you an idea. Um, Sunday the 15th, so this is for the it's called Hypnosis for Sleeping Deeply. Sunday the 15th, 739 downloads. Monday the 16th, for September 2019, 770 downloads. Tuesday the 17th, 656 downloads. Wednesday the 18th, 603 downloads bit of a drop for Thursday but it was all round really 349 downloads and then yesterday the 20th Friday the 20th 648 downloads and 38 today so far so what day Thursday the 19th uh. I'm going to go back in time just to see because again I didn't have anything between the 8th and the 11th I wonder what happened there I wonder if that was because uh, it's quite a big so the 8th and the 11th so I, did, I didn't make any new recordings onto that podcast so the 8th 652 downloads the 9th 528 downloads the 10th 431 so you see it goes down and then the 11th 821 and it is it goes down it goes up the 12th 349 13th 472 the 14th 253 Yet, on the 4th of September, 1,303 downloads. And the 5th of September, 683 downloads. And then on the 6th of September, 1,119 downloads. So I've kind of gone from, on one day, uh, this month so far... I've got a day where I had 253 downloads, which is the 14th, and then the 4th of September, 1,303. That's just almost... It's hard to kind of figure out, really. Also... On the 4th, I only added one recording. Isn't that weird? <laughs> it's really strange. So on the 4th of September, I added just one new recording for that day. And I hadn't added, yeah, I hadn't added anything since the 1st. September 
which probably explains why it's quite low to 400 plus can't figure it out. I don't understand why. I really don't. But that is the Maxi Paxi uh, podcast out of all of them. And I'm just grateful that anybody listens, really. But it's... Uh, And I don't know where they're listening. Well, I do know where they're listening, but I can't. Don't have exact statistics. So I've got sources. I've got demographics. Let's have a look what it says for demographics. We are unable to extract any demographic data from this time range. So sources. Uh, if we do the last seven days, so yesterday, 430 Apple Core Media iPhone, this is just for this podcast, uh, 26 Spotify and free generic Android app. But, if I add all the others, there's quite a few, there's lots of different places that it, it is, but yesterday, so sort of 24 Apple Corn Media Apple Watch, that's quite, I like that, so people that are listening to me on the Apple Watch. 15 Apple Core Media iPad, uh, 25 Stitcher, 8 on Google Podcasts, 19 on Castbox, 33 Generic Android App, 25 Spotify, 430 Apple Core Media iPhone. And I wonder if it's got devices. Ah, oh. again, this this is getting even more. I mean, it's predictable. You probably guess what it is if you are still listening. But <clears throat> got a little pie chart. You've got mobile, tablet, desktop, other. I've got no idea what other means, and smart speaker, which would be, I guess, yeah. Amazon Alexa is the only smart speaker that they're listing. Mobile. These are the people listening on this podcast, just this podcast. 89.7% of people are listening on a mobile phone. Tablet, 3.77%. Desktop 3.77% and other 2.54% and smart speaker 0.21%. And then it tells me on the desktop it's 54.17% Mac, Windows is 42.36%. And Linux is 3.47%. iOS 43.4%. This is mobile tablets. Android 22.81. And the watch OS 3.78%. Wow. It does make me wonder what the I'm just interested in what the uh, devices are for the whole I 
okay this is for the whole podcast just for the last uh, first of the third March ah I didn't want that I just wanted to last seven days current week Oh, it's a little bit different, but not much. So this is for all of the podcasts for the last, for the current week since Sunday. 87.41% mobile, desktop 4.42%, tablet 4.29%, other 3.35%, smart speaker 0.53% It wasn't long ago that the smart speaker wasn't even getting anything It's growing It's starting to grow I can see that starting Eventually it's going to overtake the desktop And at the moment it's just Amazon Alexa And iOS the mobile tablets iOS 59.92% Android 36.76% Watch iOS which would be the i the iWatch 3.11% Fire OS 0.20% and Windows 00 0.01% that's the Windows phone sounds popular I, I actually had a Windows phone yep you to what if it's got demographics for the whole geolocation So this is the geolocation just for the last seven days, current for the current week. Country, United States, 51.9% or 51.90%. United Kingdom, 15.04%. Australia, 8.55%. Canada, 6.82%. New Zealand 2.69% Netherlands 1.35% Sweden 1.33% Germany 1.21% Norway 1.11% Ireland 1.08% and I think this is just for the people listening or downloading on the on Spreaker not not those that are watching or listening on like Spotify or you know other places I think so Kingston these are the cities the top cities for the last since Sunday Kingsport TN United States 1.41% San Jose CA United States 1.34% Minneapolis Minneapolis MN United States 1.30% Auckland New Zealand 1.05% Brookline Ni United States 0.96% Dublin Ireland 0.85% Seattle Wa United States 
0.83%. Milwaukee, we, United States, oh, 0.80%. Atlanta, ga, United States. What does ga stand for? Atlanta, Georgia, isn't it? But what does old GA stand for? I thought Atlanta was in Georgia. United States, 0.72%. And I like the name of this. Illyria. Illyria, OH, United States. Is it Ohio? I think OH O oh. Illyria O oh. United States O point six six per cent. Oh, I wonder if I do custom Andre's dreaming, he's he's moaning. Uh, uh. Oh, it only lets me do it from March to September. So what I find interesting is there was a time, there was a time not that long ago when America was had a, a bigger proportion of the pie, <laughs> the Jason pie, and um, they probably. St I mean, I know the numbers have grown in America, but it's just nice to see that other countries. Especially places like Norway and Netherlands and Sweden and that's just groovy. Because I understand, you know, I'm English speaking so I'm gonna appeal a lot more probably to English speaking countries. Predominantly English speaking countries. Um but I think it's groovy that people in all fairness a lot of countries can speak English. I mean, it's just, I just think it's cool. There's someone that maybe English is not their first language is listening to me, and I kind of wonder what you make of me because people that whose first language is English, is English probably don't know what to make of me. So I must. I'm not sure if I make any sense at all. I mean, that's why I don't listen back to my recordings because these ones, I mean, not the hypnosis. Those ones are brilliant. They're just the relaxation, stress, anxiety podcast thing. That's top notch. I'm actually quite pleased with it. I know it might sound weird, but I'm quite pleased with that podcast the way it's coming along so let's have, let me just have a look so that's 34,762 for that podcast ah that's interesting so so the ratio changes depending on the podcast which is kind of obvious it would, but it's just interesting that for the relaxation, hypnosis, for stress and anxiety, 44.33% are from America, or the United States. 24.45% are from the United Kingdom. Australia is next at 12.65%. Canada, 4.818%. Sweden, 1.39%. 
Brazil 1.24%, Netherlands 1.13%, Italy 0.96%, France 0.92% and Germany 0.69%. And you may have noticed that the the countries are different on some here. So France wasn't on the last one, Italy wasn't on the last one, and Brazil wasn't on the last one, the last list. So they only list one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. They only list the top ten countries. So I'm being listened to by a lot more than the countries that they list. Yeah, it's quite groovy. So for this podcast, the top place where people are listening to this on Spreaker is London at 1.43%. Then Melbourne, Australia, 1%. What small percentage, <laughs> isn't it? Because again, they're not showing all the different places, so there must be loads of seas. There must be huge, hundreds. So Melbourne, Los Angeles, 0.74%. Brisbane, Australia, 0.65%. Plymouth in United Kingdom. Plymouth, 0.60%. Indianola. Indianola. That sounds like an ice cream, doesn't it? IA, United States, 0.50%. Manchester United, no, Manchester United Kingdom, 0.49%. I got excited there, I thought, wow, one of the top football teams in the world are listening to me. So, Mondal, Mondal, Sweden, I'm probably not pronouncing that right, M O E L N D A L. 0.47% Glasgow in the United Kingdom 0.47% and Belo Horizonte Brazil 0.42% hmm. That's interesting I suppose just before I go I'll just give the stats for four zero seven three ooh, 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 ooh. plays and downloads so I give the stats for this podcast. So, I forgot. I had a really couple of big days. Eighth. Oh, what are you doing? What are you doing? Last seven days. That's it. Oh, okay. So... Yeah, I've had a couple of big days. Well, one big day, but... So, Sunday the 15th, 377 downloads. Monday the 16th, 347 downloads. Now, Tuesday, for some reason, 744 downloads. Wednesday, 294 downloads. Thursday, 203 downloads and then Friday 256 downloads and 22 today so I can't um (sighs) 
18th, 19th. Okay, I didn't make a recording on the 19th. So I'll explain why there's only 203 downloads. But the 17th, why has it gone up so much? Just the standard recording, 17th. 17th, 16th, 5th, oh, got no idea. It's a Tuesday, the 17th, 744 downloads, which is a bit of a jump. Oh, it's got evolution. They've got this special thing here that says what the evolution is. And... I don't know what it means, though. Oh. According to this... I was just letting me know which ones have been the most, had the most uh, listens. So apparently, two, uh, episode 213 on the 8th of September had the biggest rise out of all the others. It just, uh, they looked like little rockets and they kind of, that one just shot up a lot quicker than the others for some reason. I don't know why. I really don't. So let's have a look at the sources. Uh, demographics. Let's see what the demographics are for this. No demographics. Geolocation. Oh, that's interesting. I don't know why. I thought that it'd be a lot more UK people listening, but there isn't. In fact, there's nobody. What well, there is, but like in the top, the top percentage of cities. So the first one is nine point six five percent Minneapolis. San Jose is 9.56%. Olympia in the United States, 4.25%. Dubai, yeah, the United Arab Emirates, 2.46%. Hurston, Australia, 1.58%. Appleton, we, United States, 1.32% Johannesburg, South Africa 1.23% uh, Dallas, TX so I guess that's Texas United States 1.18% Dundee, oh, there's one place in, in England Dundee, United Kingdom 1.01% and South Yarra, Australia, 0.96%. Uh, so they're just the top cities, but that's not all of them. And country-wise, United States, 56.49%. So a much higher percentage listen in America um, than the other podcasts or the overall podcasts. So, the United States is just 14.62%. Australia, 7.54%. Netherlands. Hello, everyone in Netherlands. 2.49%. New Zealand, 2.49%. Canada, 2.44%. United Arab Emirates, 2.40%. India, 1.63. That's the first time India's come up, isn't it? And United Arab Emirates. Uh, United Arab Emirates. Um, yeah, in countries for podcasts. So, And South Africa as well. 
to South Africa 1.24%, India 1.63%. So that's India, one, two, th three new countries. Um, the one on the list of other countries of other podcasts. And lastly, Germany, 0.99%. Now I want to test something out. I really do. It gives me the option to download report as a .csv. So, I'm going to open it up and see what it says. Because it might list all the other... Um, things as well like the other towns and cities and the other countries even though it'll be a smaller percentage instead of just having the top 10 I'm just interested in how many there are very interested I've never been more interested in my life oh it's not working oh it is Ah, no, it's just shown exactly what's on the page. Oh, it's a shame. I really hoped, really hoped. That don't matter. So, that's the stats. The statistics for now so this podcast to let me bore you to sleep which may well be your favorite podcast of everything that I do it's possibly you know they're all my children they're you know and um, you know the podcast they're all my babies so this one has a special place for me but so does the deep sleep whisper so does the relaxation hypnosis for anxiety stress and panic I mean there's a very personal connection to that one and and also there's all you know the chronic pain website the podcasts I've got and the relaxation the sleep different sleep sessions so I'm connected to all of them. And the Sleep Hypnosis Weekly as well. But this... I don't know, I've got a little... I've got a real soft spot for this. This podcast. I feel... I suppose it's because I kind of feel that I'm able to just... Be my natural boring self and that can feel quite nice quite free in in a, in a way um, because if it's entertaining then that's not necessarily a bad thing you know unless of course of this I suppose if you're trying to go to sleep you don't necessarily want to be entertained but it, like some people have said oh you you know if someone says to me oh you're too interesting well that's that's not an insult is it but if then someone says you're really boring that's a compliment anyway as well because it's supposed to be boring so it's kind of a win-win situation um If someone says, oh, you just talk about pointless stuff. Well, yeah, that's kind of the point. The point is to be pointless. Why are you just reading out all your stats? Because it's boring reading out stats. For me, it's not boring, but listening to it, that's the boring part. See, I'm not here to bore myself. I'm here to bore you. That's the difference. <laughs> See, I can I can talk about stuff that I'm interested in. Doesn't mean that anyone else is going to be. 
That's that's what's so groovy about the whole thing. So yeah, I'm gonna. I'm looking forward. That's really looking forward to hitting the hundred thousand for this podcast. I don't know why. It's just it's just a thing. It's just a little special thing for me, really. I just. Uh, Yeah, I'm quite tired now. <sighs> so much, so much for me doing a radio show. I was gonna, I was thinking about doing like a once a week radio show thing. I just can't be bothered. Oh, it's terrible, isn't it? I'd rather just do what I'm doing. Really, I think. Yeah. Yeah. Will you take care anyway? And I'll speak to you very soon. Probably tomorrow. So, thank you for listening. Remember to be kind to yourself. Because you deserve to be happy. Lots of love.